What's up, guys? It's your boy, and this is a review of Fairy Tale Zero, Episode Eight. Now, this episode is just—it's a little—it's it, a really good strategy episode. When when maybe we could, when maybe showing her her battle strategy prowess and we're creating a plan to get the people riled up. We were saying the manga, which is really good. They, where they got all the people riled up and use Warwood to distract uh, Master and Jeffrey. They use Pulit and Yuri to go to the would go into the castle or the cathedral and go fight some of the guildmates members. Well, Mavis took care. Well, well Mavis and Zara uh, took care of Master uh, Jeffrey. Now that was fucked up. Do you see the look of her fucking face? It was fucking terrifying as fuck. I would use that. I, I would use that as my thumbnail. The, the, that fucking face that she used as she was burning the people and an entire town was fucking off the chain. And it could show you how much it affected her. Uh, well, of course it affected her, but look, look, like it affected her too. Like this much, this much of a well, this much of a degree that she's willing to use this as a, as an illusion to like fuck with Master. Jeffrey, and even from his standpoint, he's like, "Oh, this is fucked up, man. You're despicable." What well, fuck? Mm. But he quickly said, "We." He said that it's a illusion, and then it disperses, and he gets crept under. The, he gets crept under on this cage. Really good. A really good strategized plan from Mason's standpoint. We go back, and he's like, "You can, no, you can't physically touch the a Chinro gem because it's not like a magical item; it's a fucking evil curse gem." And who if such as we get cursed? Now, I said this, I said this many times in my reviews. That Yuri is different from Roxas and Makarov and Ivan. But he was kind of a badass, hard ass, and well, and I'm for this episode. Because, like, he's going back to this, like, he's like he's different from Makarov. He just don't want, like, he just don't, wasn't, he doesn't like to help people. He wants to get the goal, get. He was to get the goal, get to the goal, have it, we're done. And that's what, and that's, well, and that's something that I like about Yuri, that he, that he's different from all the rest of his family. Now, he, like, after, after getting to the gym, he touches it and turns into this big fucking dragon. And I'm wondering what kind of a dragon that was before it died. I, I don't know why, but I'm just wondering about it. But maybe it's at the end with their treasure is the friendship power. No. 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 Fairy tale, you went eight, eight episodes long without saying one friendship speech. Now you want to start now? That, that was the part of the episode. I was just like, oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. But the next episode, Law. Is it Fairy Law? Jesus fucking Christ. Zara created Fairy Law. What the fuck is this shit, man? But it's a good episode of Fairy Tale Zero. Episode 8. With good development. Well, good progression on the story. With Blue Skull. And. Oh, yeah. So, this is a good episode. If you like this review, please give me a like, comment, subscribe for videos. And have a good day like we live. Bye.